All right, welcome back to Dynamite City. High in calcium, low in fat. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're bad for you. Just like your parents. But unlike your parents, we love you. I think yeah. the exit should be around here somewhere. There should be an elephant dropping out of the ceiling, right? Just any moment now. Nice elf. Oh, I love how I'm going into the fucking boss fight with my shit wrench. <laughs> and your broke, busted ass ride pod. And. Yeah. Fortunately, I know how to beat this. I'm gonna guess, uh, make jokes about its mother until it, uh. It loses so much self-esteem, it just leaves. Until it loses so much self-esteem, it kills its mother. Oh, I thought that... I thought the clown was going to do a stick swanton bomb on you. <laughs> it's just elbow drop from all the way up there. The wind-up performer. I like that. And I think it has a cool name. My poor little Halloween! <laughs> Clowns and Halloween don't really mix. Don't you get it? That is... Yeah, just blend them up. Just give it up already. Ooh, I wouldn't cop that at I wouldn't cop that feel if I were you. To be fair, this guy, I would not give up my blame either. Cause yeah, that, that is... That is big pimpin'. That gets more pussy than Mustache Man. Fucking Mustache Man. Mustache Man, wherever you are, get yourself checked. Alright, so I gotta get this super secret photo from this clown when it shoots a missile out of its eyeball. Out of its eyeball? Yeah. I, I know how to do the row bomb thing. Okay. All quiet on the set. There. Oh. It's a very small window of opportunity. Yeah, it's gonna do it. Yeah. Uh. Yep. Clown row is attacked. Heal save something. Do, do a thing. Do the heal save. Do a thing. Use the ghost wrench. Use the <laughs> haunt its screws. All right, so this guy, you have to grab his nose and then throw it back at him. Uh, like an infant. But unlike an infant, you then have to beat it. Oh, no. Aim no, for the head. What? Aim with the wrench? I'm really aiming. Sick. Rich. Oh, I wanted to, like, Combo. kick it. Like the... Kick it in the teeth. Let's kick this war in the teeth. Here's the thing. The timing on that. He throws another bomb right... This boss actually has uh, 14 different pictures in the deck. You need to make an entire. Uh... Oh, yeah, I forgot to actually take the picture of Halloween. Yeah, I blocked that missile. <laughs> Ow! I was not expecting him to use fists. That's what she said. Let's make a joke about fisting. Let's make a joke about fisting. Let's make a joke about fisting. Dude, it's too soon. Too soon? Yeah. After what? You mean the great before what? This disaster of. <laughs> you mean before what, John? Oh no. You know what's coming. Shit, guys. Shit. You gotta help me. The sanctity of my anus is in danger. Like, comment, subscribe to help. It helps. Seriously, though, it does help. Like, commenting, and subscribing. It keeps us. On track, making episodes of the utmost quality. As I, as I make this episode, have, have we had any uh, likes or comments? Or subscriptions? I don't know. Be the first, be the last. Be both. Be the one guy. <laughs> be that one guy. Dude, I haven't, I haven't uploaded anything yet. Oh, I was running away from him. It's like, ah, he's down on his feet.
Right. Ooh, I caught it out of midair. You missed it, John. I got this washable spool glue. John's gonna sniff glue. Not the kind that you can sniff. That would be irresponsible. He's just. Yeah, it doesn't smell like much. He's just sniffing white glue. Oh, snap. Guess what I saw. Bella done kissing my girl on the mouth. Done kissing her? Uh, did you ever listen to. Smash Mouth? No, 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 no. It's a uh, Biz Marquee. Just a Friend by Biz Marquee. Oh, snap by Biz Marquee. That would be wrong. Heal. He healed him. This guy's oh, not that snap. hard. I'm just fighting with a terrible weapon right now. Don't worry, this will be the only boss bite in which I fight and miss completely a lot. He claims. Oh, I'll, I'll miss. I just will have a better weapon next time. Except I don't think that the Whoa. next... I, okay. I think the next boss move. actually is fought Stand exclusively with up. guns. Look at the butterfly. Whoa, look at that. There's like some kind of persona aesthetic going on under there. Recording. It's the goddamn dark hour. Oh fuck, clown's coming in for the kill! What's <laughs> that? You got me, buddy. <laughs> that would hurt so much. They didn't bring a cot. They're just like, you grab his legs, I'll grab his arms. <laughs> I was like, well, we retrieved his legs and arms. <laughs> The way out? <laughs> Zoom in closer. Little closer. Too close! I don't know. I'm just expecting the trope of, and then he has a flashback about his mom. And then he thought about his mother. As he often did in his reclusion days. Oh, man. I, I, I hope you guys like flashbacks about your moms. Because <laughs> this game is chock full of them! Flashbacks about your moms and flashbacks about your noms. Food, not Vietnams. Shit's too soon. Yeah. It's too soon for Vietnam. <laughs> should uh, should wait until at least springtime. Whoa! It's a bunch of bullshit. Oh look, it's pretty. Except we turned down the blur. <laughs> It would be pretty if I had glasses. <laughs> Try to blur just playing with, as a short-sighted character. <laughs> <coughs> Did they ever use that as a uh, thing to explain why the draw distance was so short? No, but I can see it being done well in like an indie game where eh, they do it so that it sounds like it's a cool idea. Like, oh wow, this this character is short-sighted. This character is far-sighted. They're good at different things. I think they do that in our Rogue Legacy. Rogue Legacy? Yeah. Alright, is that the Iron Bridge? Yeah. That one. That's cool. It's also the same Iron Bridge. Man, this Iron Bridge has a huge goddamn hitbox. Yeah. Okay, so you got Brave Little and the uh, uh, Clown Super Attack. Yep. And, okay. So Those are the missable photos, I believe. Alright, and then I just gotta walk here, and it triggers a cutscene. Because this game is full of cutscenes. Oh, it's almost as if it was a JRPG. Welcome back to JRPGs. That was the first time I had it was seen the first time I'd seen it. If you're just joining us now, I hope you like plots. Because we're not doing much right now. I'm bouncing oh. my phone over my stomach. The sky that really is it's totally excellent. picking up on the mic. But I was yet to realize that great changes were happening in the oh. world. <laughs> Beep! <laughs> Wait, this is the only train in the world. What is it supposed to beep out of the way? This guy must be shitting himself. The fuck is this? The fuck is that? The fuck are these? Cedric, what are Not you doing? my dad. What are you doing here? 
Cedric the Entertainer. You surprised? The Blackstone Railroad's back and ready for action. That so angry, and his dick is so huge. And then they walked into his dick. <laughs> they walked in. That's classic. Look at that. It's a fucking dra- Why don't they make shit like this ever? They've never made shit look they, like they, this. They have made things that stylized in the 1800s. And then it was... It was discarded in favor of more uh, practical... What's it called? Streamlined. Practical, streamlined, industrial aesthetics. I do like industrial aesthetics, but that, that right there is... This game's got like a weird steampunk. Yeah, they, they used to have like uh, going. It's not steampunk, but it's something like that. This is what I found out from Need. His story. It was 15 years ago. So it was 15 years ago. And no one fucking remembers it was the rest of the world. What exactly happened? You don't need this letter to tell you that, do you, Mother? Listening to Cedric's story. Uh, okay, so we don't get to know. 15 years ago, the world was laid to waste. And all that remains oh, everyone's doing pretty good for the world being laid to waste 15 years ago. Except for Palm Brinks. Our enemy, the one who destroyed everything, was a mysterious ruler. Also, I think this is like the only part of the plot that's like the main plot that we get. Everything else is like subplots. Also destroyed Palm Brinks was because of a stone. Yes, the stone. Griffin's henchmen, and that's why. Who would name their kid or themselves Flops? With this if you had a brother whose name was already Jetson, it came from outside. Then you would match. Go check it out. You would be the shit in the water twins. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, uh. Take a picture oh, of that. Firehouse. I think this is the only time I can take a picture of the firehouse. Because it'll always be closed otherwise. All right. At least they're not posing for pictures anymore. Yeah, let's... gentlemen, let's take this at least a little bit seriously. Let the police sheriff turn the hi hi. I'm sorry, I can't pronounce Japan. I can. Japan. And for our Mexican viewers, glorious Nippon. Nippon. All right, so so Kawaii is cute and Kawaii is scary, right? Yes. I I can I can see intentionally mixing those up to uh, be funny. To be funny, and cute as like a nickname for some. What the fuck? That clown is a machine gun. I'm not ready to deal with this. Yep. Look at that. Also, I love how you fight him. I love this. She's like Max. Throw these bombs at him. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, <laughs> I wouldn't know otherwise. <laughs> Big old bomb brand bomb. <laughs> bomb brand bomb. From Bombco. <laughs> you toss it, and I'll grab another one. I'm I'll grab another one. We have a big stockpile of them on the only train. You know. Well, that's the only train not using it for much. You just put stuff in it. Yeah, it's probably like. Uh, I bet they were using it for storage. These were just big wheel cars for a while. Did you gotta take a picture of that bitch? I don't know. Uh, don't think so. No, I can't. We already got a picture of a car from the guy in the bar. Oh yeah. Oh, I hate that. He switches sides because. Bitch. Because he's an independent. Blowing up the train isn't going to help. Says you. Says you, like, I wonder if I should be giving this kid bombs. Just destroying the countryside. Oh, God, Smokey the Bear's going to be pissed. <laughs> Seriously, I'm just throwing bombs in the woods. I don't really know what I'm doing. Oh, oh come on. This is a sick dodge. He rolled. Boom! Boom, motherfucker! KO'd a clown car? That was a clown car! It's on fire! Do something, you worthless lump! He was on the dying. 
Herb, stomp your ass. Look at this. <laughs> Throw more bombs at me. He had this as a backup plan. In case they threw bombs at him. I'll shoot you in the fucking face, you fat fuck. Doesn't she? Oh. Don't you ever give up? You're starting to look pretty pathetic. What's this? She does look pretty pathetic for the record. A half-naked man in clown makeup, covered in sticks of dynamite. Yeah, this is that's not. A, that's a new low. This is like the definition of rock bottom. He had pants. He decided to take them off. He decided that today was no longer the day for pants. It is not the time for pants. And then this chick showed up, and without missing a beat, it's... cuts him into pieces. No, uh, he only showed like, up the diamond line. <laughs> and then shot him. You kicked him off first, and then shot the fire at him. It blown his ass up. That would have looked cool too. I mean, not that it didn't look cool. So that was how I met Monica. And that's how we ended the video.